Hello, welcome back to Elizabeth Explores. Today we're in Los Angeles, California at the Chevron Santa Monica gas station. And for Maisel Day, all of LA is acting like we're back in the 1950s. When the price of the pump is this good, it's worth a picture. Wow. 30 cents for a gallon. And check out this publicity stunt to get Emmy votes. The traffic tells otherwise. What the hell is that happening? The gas station, they're offering 30 cents to a gallon, which is, I mean, hello? Hello? That's crazy. So this is really cool. We're going to fill up our gas and we have somebody pumping our gas for us. What kind of gas would you like? So how are you enjoying the day? Busy? Yeah. Yeah. You don't usually pump gas. There's no pumping gas in California. Did they do this in the 1950s? Did they pump gas for you? Yes. Oh, they did. So everybody pumped gas in all the states, huh? I didn't know that. They still pump your gas in New Jersey and New York, which is where I'm from. Yeah. Cool. Check this out. 280. Is it full? 280. Is it full? You think? I think so. I think so. Look at that. 284. We're all filled up and gassed up and we're gonna go get a pastrami sandwich. Okay, let's go. Yeah, yeah. Okay, let's keep it going. And we have proof 284 to fill up for gas in Santa Monica, California. Oh my god, how does it feel, Nova? It feels amazing. <laughs> Do you I, think this will ever happen again? No. <laughs> this is actually the best day of my life. This is honestly, I don't think I ever want to get gas again. I think I'm done. Yeah. I think I'll just take the bus from now on. You got the yeah. gas. This is the highlight. This is no. just amazing. Yeah. Can't even beat this. All right, let's see. Is it filled up? Where do I look? Oh, yeah. Right over here on the monitor. <laughs> Bam. Full gas for like 284. Yes. Amazing. Yeah. Amazing. This guy's getting out of this. We have a lot, of, a lot of haters. They're like, get out of this town. <laughs> we don't want you. The gas station's next door. Like, what the hell? And the news stations are here. It's a whole day. Yeah. This is Fairfax Avenue. It's a little ways down um, past Beverly Hills and a little bit in West Hollywood. Cantor's Deli is a gem of Los Angeles. It's where you know all ho old Hollywood glamour people um, would come and dine here, like Frank Sinatra and Marilyn Monroe, and um, you know all the the greats. President Obama made a surprise appearance here once, and lots of. Um, TV shows were filmed like Mad Men and uh, yeah when you look around it still looks exactly the same as it did in the 1930s I mean I haven't been here in the 1930s but when you look at the pictures from when it was um, established it looks pretty much the same Yeah, there's lots of history. A lot of the, the people that work here have been working here for 20 years or so. What we're getting today is the, I don't know, I don't think it says on here, but we're getting the Maisel sandwich, the Maisel special. We're going to get pastrami on rye, potato salad, and french fries, and matzo ball soup. We have to get that too. Pastrami sandwich is only $1.50, and that's what it was in 1950s. I think today it's like $16. So we're really getting the 1950s experience and it's very happy and, and fun and we're really enjoying it already. I can't wait to, to eat. We're going to show you that too. So stay tuned. It'll be the next clip. And just a little fun fact note about Cantor's is they have all homemade breads and homemade pickles. So we're going to have pickles too. Okay. You want one? Oh wow. I'm really good. <laughs> you want one? <laughs> okay. I'm gonna eat all this actually. Okay. Yeah. okay, so we also got the matzo ball soup. 
Inova, have you ever tried matzo ball soup? I've never had matzo ball soup. Like, so I saw it and I, I was like, wait, it's literally like a matzo ball. <laughs> ball, 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 ball. Do I just... Yeah, take a little bit of the broth, a little bit of the ball. Okay. Oh my gosh. Ooh. Oh, it's hot. Hot. Ooh, it's fun. Yeah? Mmm. Yeah. It's kind of hearty. Mm. Yum. It kind of reminds me of Thanksgiving for some reason. Yeah. Like, yeah. All right, we got the we got the Maisel experience here. We had to do even more than what Ma Mrs. Maisel has to offer us today. Even more than just the pastrami sandwich on rye. We got the matzo ball soup, as we said. We got some French fries, and of course, we had to get the pastrami on rye. And if you're gonna get if you're gonna get the pastrami, you gotta get it on rye. Just don't get it on any other kind of bread, okay? Oh, and don't forget the potato salad. Oh my goodness, I'm really excited to try it. Should I dive in? Okay, cheers. Look at how beautiful it is. It's starting to fall out. I gotta eat it fast. Okay. Oh, that's good. Ooh. For not being a New York deli, LA's doing quite all right. Yeah, really good. All right, we gotta go eat. We'll be back in a little bit. locations at all the very hot spots of LA. You can find one on Sunset Boulevard. There's one near Rodeo Drive, West Hollywood, Hollywood, Sherman Oaks. They have all different branches all around LA. Usually around, you know, like I said, a hub of things where you can kind of bounce around and do different touristy spots. 1947, the first Mills was in San Francisco. And then they multiplied to 11 restaurants. And then in 1972, the San Francisco uh, branch of Mills was uh, discovered by George Lucas, who featured the restaurant in the movie American Graffiti. So that's why Mills Drive-In is, I think, kind of blew up in its popularity because of that movie American Graffiti. You can often find celebrity sightings here, so I'm keeping an eye out today. At this location in particular, they're filming, Amazon is filming here for the Maisel Day. So they're getting really excited about this called 1950s day for one day only here in LA and uh, promoting Mrs. Maisel, the show on Amazon, which you have to check out. It's amazing. Thanks, guys. And we're waiting now for our burger, fries, and a milkshake. So stay tuned. In the next clip, we'll have it. Ready? Movie magic. <laughs> All right, we got our burger with fries, and we got a milkshake too. We got vanilla. We're getting the vanilla milkshake with a good old cherry on top and some whipped cream. And okay, so normally a burger, a cheeseburger, and fries is about sixteen, seventeen dollars in 2019, and a milkshake is about eight to nine dollars. So some quick math. What is that? Like thirty dollars almost if you have tips and you pay for parking and you drive here and all that good stuff. You wanna know how much we paid? Okay, drum roll. <laughs> we paid two dollars. Two. I put three dollars on the table. That's with tip and everything. $3 for all of this. $3 and that's for two. Oh my god. My mind's blown. Okay, so. <laughs> <laughs> it's worth it. Yeah. Woo. Amazon. Amazon. Did you even get well, I, well, I was filming myself. <laughs> oh. No, I did. I took a bite. 
Okay. See, look, but I was trying to play it cool because I was trying to be like uh, dainty, you know. Yeah. <laughs> so he found me out. I I did. I know too much of, too much uh, movie magic here. I was only nibbling a little bit. So so yeah. So Amazon is filming here today, right behind me. <laughs> and Rover and I got filmed for Amazon. Should take a real bite, don't you think? All right, here I go. Looks good. I've already nibbled it like a bunny rabbit. <laughs> I'm milking. Then you got the crispy fries. Did I just eat pastrami not that long ago? Yeah. Did I also eat matzo ball soup? Oh, yeah. Big steak fries. French fries. Yeah. Pickles. Oh wow. Yeah. Whatever. You know, girls gotta eat. This episode of Elizabeth Explores. It was so much fun exploring Maisel Day out here in LA. And we are ending the day here in Pacific Palisades. We're gonna go right behind us to McConnell's and grab some 25 cent ice cream. And I'm beside these beautiful Maisel ladies. They look beautiful. Look at their beautiful dresses. All in sync and everything. So it was super fun. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to comment down below what your favorite part of the video was. And don't forget to tune in on Amazon to Marvelous Mrs. Maisel. It's one of the best shows ever and you're gonna love it. It's so fun to watch. And it's nice to transport back into the 50s. I had so much fun paying the 50s prices. Saved a lot of money and it was so much fun. So thank you so much for watching. Make sure you comment, like, subscribe. Do all the things. I don't remember all the YouTube things, okay? All right. See you next time. Okay. Okay, bye. For me, my name is Mrs. Maisel. Thank you and good night.